Hi everyone, this is Emmy. Today I'm going to show you how to make these very easy pecan clusters. Lots of times when you're invited to a party, you want to bring something along. And these can be made up in no time at all and brought along and everyone will be impressed and everyone will love them. And I placed a link below for all my recipe videos. So I have two glasses in hot water and I have some light chocolate chips melted in one. And in the other, I have the white chocolate chips. And if your liquid is a little bit thick, you can add a bit of margarine or coconut oil. And I placed a piece of wax paper on a cookie sheet, and I put a little bit of water under the wax paper to keep it from moving around. First, I'm going to start with just a teaspoon of chocolate. And I'm going to place three pecans inside. Now on here you could add something. You could put some orange zest or you could put a little dab of peanut butter or Nutella. I'm just going to leave these plain to make the first ones. So now I take a teaspoon of the vanilla flavor and put that down. Sprinkle with whatever you like. I'm going to just put a few of these little mini chocolate chips. And then I'm going to drizzle with the chocolate again. And that's the basic pecan cluster. And if you would like to make something more substantial, start out with a purchased cookie. And we're going to do the same thing on top of the cookie. A teaspoon of chocolate, three pecans, a teaspoon of white chocolate, a sprinkling of little mini chips and then a drizzle of chocolate. Okay, I have a tray full made and I'm going to set them up in the refrigerator and then I'll come back and show you when they're finished. So these are the ones that I made on a purchased pecan cookie. These are just simply made right on the waxed paper. This one was made on a purchased oatmeal cookie. And these were made on some digestive cookies. And I have a clear plate here. I'm going to use some of these little cupcake liners. And place one in a cupcake liner. Like that, and just set them up. And on these, I eliminated the drizzle of chocolate. So it makes them look different, but it's exactly the same. So there you go, a very easy recipe. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.